Alright, it's time to make a video. I need to get my clothes right though. So, babe, can you throw me my shirt and my hat? Looks straight. Let's get into it. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? It's time for another tutorial from video editing software guy.com. Alright people, I generally don't recommend changing your clothes without taking a shower, but we're about to get into the change clothes effect right now in Cyberlink Power Director 12 Ultimate. Let's get into it. First things first, you got to do all your takes at once. Now that means say what you're going to say and throw the clothes. Now, I will admit that I didn't do that when I did this effect and I could have did it all over again but my wife cannot throw very well and it took a long time it took like about eight ten takes to get it done and I was tired so what I did is I did an extra split of my clips and I'll show you how I did that in this but you know if you got a, a wife or a friend with a good throwing arm you want to try to do it right the first time around so say your statement throw the clothes all right if it's not done right start over from the beginning say the statement again Throw the clothes again. If you're throwing a hat, make sure they throw the hat at the head. If you got a shirt, throw it at the chest. And if you're using pants or shoes, throw it at the correct body part as well. All right? Do that until you got your takes right. And then you got to do a take of yourself with the different clothes on, the clothes that you threw at yourself. All right? Make sure that when you do the, the take of you with the clothes on that you threw at yourself, that you're standing or sitting in the exact same spot to make it look as realistic as possible. And the rest of the toot is all about splitting your clips in the right place. So let's get to splitting. All right. So as you can see, I got my takes here. And I got my first take when I set my statement. It's right here, just talking and, you know, doing my thing. And then the clothes get thrown. As you can tell, the clothes did not hit me at the correct place. So I had to split the clip. Now, like I said, you should do it over again from the beginning. All right. So I'm going to move this to a position where I think I want to split this clip. And I'll go right here for now. I'm going to split this clip here. Next, I'm going to move to the next position where I know the hat was pretty much thrown correctly. So let's see here. And the hat got thrown right on my head and the shirt's right there. So I like that. So I'm going to move this back to a spot to when the hat is first and the shirt are first being thrown. I don't want any shadows in there. So I'm going to move back to where there's no shadows. And you can tell there's some shadows in the bottom right corner. And as I go frame by frame you can see the shadows disappearing and that's what I'm looking at I'm making these shadows go away and I like that there so I'm gonna split this clip here then I'm gonna go to a spot where the shirt is thrown and the hat is thrown and they're both touching me like right when they first touch me I think that's a pretty good spot there. I'm going to split this. And then I'm going to go to a spot right before or right after I got my clothes on. And I got my clothes on here. So I want to go back a little bit to before I say my statement. And I'm going to split this here. Alright, so this is the end where I'm talking stuff, so I know I need to get rid of this clip, so I'm going to go ahead and click on the clip, and then I'll click on the trash can, and remove and move clips on same track, so that 
closes that gap up. And then I also know that this part here I don't need because this little part right here is when the stuff gets thrown. So I'm going to click on this clip and I'm going to click on the trash can to remove it. And then I'm going to select remove and move clips on the same track. And bam. Should be good to go. Now when I play this back because it's not fully rendered, you're probably going to see some jumpiness. But let's just take a look at it anyway. Tell me my shirt and my hat. Look straight. There it is. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, all right? Change clothes effect. Inside Blink, Power Director 12 Ultimate. All right, peeps. You know the routine. The thumb. The one that's pointed in the upward direction. Click it. Like it. Live it. Love it. Hug it. Hug the heck out of it, okay? Comments. I love your comments, people. I will always try to help you. If I can't help you, I'll point you in the right direction so that you can get the help you deserve. And last, but definitely not least, don't you ever forget to subscribe, baby. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.